Hey YouTube, this is the iPad with another app review. Today we're going to be going over the Dish Network app. It's a pretty handy little app. If you have Dish Network at your home, that's the service that you use and you have their DVR. Uh, we have the Hopper here. But if you have that, you can get this thing called the Sling Adapter. It's uh, pretty small. It's probably 4 by 6 inch flat piece of metal. And uh, it just plugs into your DVR with a USB cable and it's ready to go. But you get that and you can set up um, to watch Dish Network live TV on your iPad, your iPhone, your uh, computer, anything. And, um, and it plays live TV for you. So you open up the app and it goes straight into your showcase items, uh, the shows featured on demand and uh, sports that are live right now. Again, this is live TV, so if there's a sport on, you can watch it live with everybody else. We'll go ahead and go to guide here. This is showing the guide that I have available right now. It's it's all your channels that you'd have on your regular TV. So you just kind of scroll through. And we've got history channel. You can either select the HD version or the standard. We'll go ahead and hit standard so it loads quicker. Now you can hit record and it'll start recording on your DVR for you. So if you're not home and you forgot to set the DVR, you can uh, use this and, and hit record. We'll go ahead and select watch on iPad. Wait for it to load. And it does show. It usually shows the last couple seconds of the, the last show that you're watching just while it's loading up. That's what it's doing right now. Alright, here we go. This is the History Channel live right now. Seemingly insignificant rocks that were overlooked for decades. And you can see that it's pretty good quality. I mean, it would be better if I hit the HD. But. There it is, and if uh, if you have low signal, you can go up here and select. Um, it's in standard quality right now, but you can change it to high quality. Go ahead and do that and see how it works. And again, it'll take a few seconds to load. And this does work on. I'm on Wi-Fi right now, so it works best on Wi-Fi. But it does work on 3G. So if you have two bars it'll work uh, it might lag a little bit but three bars is uh, where it starts working pretty well without any issues alright here it is on high definition you can see it's it's great quality it's hundreds of feet thick and extends deep below go ahead and get out of that so that's your guide you can select movies shows sports family favorites all that up here pretty much just like on your remote control you can also go to my DVR and since it's plugged into your DVR you can watch anything that's on your DVR. We recorded the Hatfields and McCoys show. Okay, I'll go ahead and resume it. I'll probably start at the end of the end of the show. Year in, year out, coral reefs decay naturally. Alright, there it is. Like I hit resume so it started when it stopped recording, so but uh if you hit start over it'll There we go, it should start from the beginning now. But anything you have on your DVR and I have the uh movie channels, HBO, Stars, Cinemax, Showtime, all of that. There you go. But on those movie channels, you can record those also, and you can watch those also live, which is a pretty cool feature. I mean, you usually don't get that kind of stuff with the the paid channels like that. And then Blockbuster at Home, you can click on that if you have that service. I believe it's $8 a month through Dish. But uh, it's got all the movies from your Blockbuster at Home, just like on the setup on your TV. And you click them, and it plays just like uh, just like the live TV. But that is the Dish Network app. It's a pretty neat app. It's it's free. The Sling Adapter costs $30, which is a pretty good deal for what it gives you. Alright, thanks guys, and go ahead and hit subscribe and see what I've got coming up next. Thanks.